Hi guys, welcome back to another video. You're here bringing you the next episode of my Chelsea Garage on FIFA 18. Today we will be kicking our campaign off in the Champions League at home to Roma, um, as well as playing Arsenal at home in the league and then Bournemouth away in the Carabao Cup third round. Three games, three competitions and uh, let's get into the game against Roma at home and hope that we can kick off our Champions League ca campaign with all three points. The Chelsea team, Courtois in goal, Zappa Costa, Rudiger, David Luiz and Cahill uh, and Alexandro at the back in the five-man back line. Kante and Bakayoko in midfield with Eden Hazard, Morata and Pedro leading the line. As for Roma, they have Alisson in goal, uh, Karlsdorp, Fazio, Manolas and Kolarov at the back with De Rossi, Nyan Golan, Gonat Lons, Perotti, Dzeko and Lamella making up the remainder of their team in a 4-1 2-1 or 4-3-3 three, three, narrow formation. But with that said, let's get into the first half and pick up three points. In for nine gun and he's through already, firing wide of the target. Good chance for Roma. Nine Golan could and should have already made it 1-0. Lovely ball into Alexandro. Back post for Pedro, but not quite there, unfortunately. Back Yoko to Kante. Get the shot away. Off the post. Hazard off the post again. He's there, though. And it's offside from whoever it was that took the final shot, unfortunately. Great chance. Kante off the post, then Hazard off the post. And we're still nil-nil. Why did you turn like that? I have no idea. We've lost out on the ball now, which is a shame. Can play Kante in, but it wasn't... Too good, unfortunately, but we're drawing a half time nil nil. Very even game. What are Atletico Madrid doing? They are drawing away from home against Hoffenheim at half time. So we're, we're okay at the moment, but a win is needed to put ourselves into that better position. We've had four shots, one on target. They've had two shots, one on target. Just need to take the chances a little bit better in the second half. Hazard has space to run into and does. Manages to keep it as well, or not. I make a change. 20 minutes to go. Just, I don't know what it is, but something just isn't quite working. Get Bakayoko off for Fabregas. Get Pedro off for Willian. See if that adds extra creation ability and pace up top. Or in the final third, should I say. Pedro. Kante. Nice ball. In behind for Hazard. Didn't shoot like I asked him to. Otherwise, that would most likely have been 1-0 before the changes have even been made. Yes, come on. Zappa Costa to Morata. What a chance. That's going to be full time. Any minute now, unless we can nick it. Unless we can nick it. It's not. It's full time. At Stamford Bridge in match day one of the Champions League. It ends Chelsea nil, Roma nil. All I need to hope is that Athletic have drawn it with their game away from home against Hoffenheim and they haven't. They've won 2-1. Unfortunately, but <sighs> such a shame. Such a shame. But um... oh dear. We should still be in the top two or in the chance. Only more. Okay, Costa, you're fair enough. You'll play any game against Bort in the next game against Arsenal. Um, oh, that's frustrating. But Arsenal next at home. Um, yeah, let's jump straight into it. The Chelsea team I've gone with for this game at home to Arsenal. Courtois in goal. Moses, Aspilicueta, David Luiz, Cahill and Alonso at the back. Kante and Bakayoko in midfield with Costa, Willian and Hazard making up the front three. Let's go into the game now and take a look at who Arsenal have fielded. The Arsenal team, check in goal. Bellerin, Mertesacker, Koscielny, Mustafi and James Milner at the back. Ramsey and Cazorla in midfield with Urzik, Lacazette and Sanchez, as you'd expect, making the front three. They've gone with exactly the same formation as us. Let's hope that we can win it and maintain our 100% win rate in the league this season. Bellerin, straight in behind from Mesut Urzil. Good tackle from Marcus Alonso. They have the corner as a result, Arsenal. 
It's anti Kazuola to take it. Good area. Off the post, rolling across the line. Oh my god, Lacazette into Alexis. Simple catch for Courtois. That was 1 0. Thankfully, it rolled across the line, and Aspen Equator was able to get it away. Ozil, Milner, Lacazette into Alexis Sanchez. A dangerous front three that Arsenal have. Moses was there, but. A penalty? My, the commentator just said a penalty. For what? What? What did I do? Oh, seriously. Oh. Lacazette against Courtois. It's 0 0 at Stamford Bridge. Is it 1 0 now? I thought he scored that. I thought he scored that right into the corner. He went for the cheeky chip. I stayed in the middle. But he poked it wide. We're still drawing 0-0 after 10 minutes. Arsenal with two great chances in the first 10 minutes. Lacazette. David Luiz hunting him down. Can he come away with it? He can. Aspilicueta couldn't quite get it any further away. Because passing is better. We've still got it. Moses is there using the pace that he's got. Lovely ball up to William. Inside now. And again. This is nice. The play has on in behind. He's in. A cross goal. 1 0 check with a simple save behind for the corner. This has been a frantic first half an hour at the bridge. Has up with the corner. Cahill. Or not. Alonso. Blocked. William, please. It's 1 0. After all of Arsenal's pressure, Chelsea take the lead. Amazing. Arsenal have had five, six great chances to score. They had that one off the post, and they had the penalty, and missed them both. Winning was there, right place at the right time to tuck it home, and duly did. We're winning. And Arsenal should be at least 3-3, three, three, possibly even 4 new up at this point. To Alexis back to Lacazette. David Luiz hunting him down, because all a nice one-two play. Very nice one-two play from Arsenal. They should be in, and they've missed again. Half and half time is on the horizon, and Chelsea are winning one. They're probably their only sh our only shot on target. That is it. The stats at half time are going to show that Arsenal were all over us. Literally, they deserve to be in front, and they're not. Let's have a look at the stats at half time then, because Arsenal had a number of great chances. Liverpool are beating Burnley, uh, Manchester City are drawing away from Manchester Watford. They drew actually. Let's have a look. Oh, ho, ho. seven shots, two on target for Arsenal. And they are losing to a Chelsea side who have had three shots, two on target. We've been, we haven't even been much more clinical than that. Well, we have, because we've got one more shot on target. That's insane. Into the second half we go. The half row, it's not, it's theirs. Right, let's make a change. While well, we've got the chance to try and make sure we defend the lead. Kante's there, Bakayoko's on there. Uh, we're going to get... Costa, I don't know what to do. Uh, he hasn't had a particularly good game, but I want to keep him on. Uh, ooh. Who can I bring on? Uh, we've got Alexandra on for Alonso for the time being. Um, and that'll do. Because Alexandra is the slightly better player, so he will be able to give us extra defensive duties, hopefully. David Luiz, nice hitter. Kante. Play Hazard in. That's lovely. Do what he does. Hazard, 2-0. It is an undeserved lead. A very undeserved lead. It's game, set, match. Thanks to a brilliant run and goal by Eden Hazard. Lovely high free ball from Kante to get it to him. And then just... Does what he does. He turned, ran into the space that he had available to him and did a typical Hazard thing. We're 2 0 up with less than 10 minutes to go. It's his second goal in the league this season. A lead that is highly undeserved. Oh, Moses, even. Can I play William in? Yes, right. Moses lost that. 3 0. 
3-0. Thanks to Costa. He wanted to play a game and he has done. It's like, yeah, you know, I had this question, asked myself this question in the last episode when we had that 6-5 against Everton. Whether well, professional is too easy. And then you see the mistake that Lacazette made for the penalty, but then that's down to the him or it could it, it depends. Uh, you know, it's not been it's been a struggle at times. You know, we were on the back foot for the first half an hour and then we got that goal with William. So there is still that question, the fifty fifty question. You know based off of the chances Arsenal have had 3 0 to us. A 3 0 win to us isn't the right scoreline, but that is half uh, half time, though. No, that's full time. It's 3 0. They had, before we scored, they had the, the post and then the save. Oh no, hold on, what? They had the post from Alexis Sanchez and the penalty missed from uh, Lacazette, didn't they? But uh, into the next, uh, the third and final game now, away from home against Bournemouth in the third round of the Carabao Cup. The Chelsea team I've gone with, Eduardo in goal. Zappa Costa, Rudy Gutt, Clark Salter, Aspilicueta and Baba at the back. Fabregas and Drinkwater in midfield with William Rata and Musonda lining up in the front three. Bournemouth, Begovic in goal. Francis, Sanchez, Cook and Daniels at the back. Albrighton, Arta, Sermon, Ibe, Defoe and Josh King, I believe that is up top in a 4-4-1-1 formation. Let's get into the first half. And get ourselves into the next round. Got time and the space, but loses out to Harry Arter. Defoe. He's in, Defoe. Not good for us. Oh, that's a great ball to Jordan. Side netting from him. Ratter again. Fabregas. Baba. Misonda. Back to Baba. Into that gap for Fabregas. Into the middle for Drinkwater. Take the shot on. Into the back of the net. 22 minutes gone and we have taken the lead with our deadline day signing of Drinkwater. Our real life deadline day signing of Drinkwater, should I say. Lovely goal. Bournemouth have had chances and they haven't taken them. They left Drinkwater in far too much space. And uh, we found him and he poked one home with a lot of range, a lot of power, a lot of accuracy. Big Rich, not quite enough on it. 1-0 Chelsea. Defoe to King. Oh, Jordan into the box. But Eduardo comes out and catches. Nicely done. Musonda, there we go. Half time. Bournemouth nil, Chelsea 1 at the Vitality. Thanks to uh, the goal from... Who was it? I can't even remember. Drinkwater, the absolute screamer from outside of the box. Into the second half we go now and hope that we can confirm the win. Get ball into the middle for King. Diverts round Rudiger quite well there. Oh, Arta into the back of the net. Not well defended at all. And Bournemouth have started the second half brightly with a good piece of attacking play. Arta not picked up. Fabregas making a pointless tackle and it's Bournemouth 1, Chelsea 1 at the start of the second half. Morata, Musonda, back to Morata. Tries to keep it and does so. Can we get the shot away? Fabregas, lovely goal. 2-1, straight back in front. Fabregas with the lovely goal. It's the two central midfielders of Chelsea scoring the goals today. Didn't think that came off though. You'll see it better from this first angle. Got crowded, but did well to keep it. Through the, keeper, uh, through the defender's legs. And Begovic had absolutely no chance. It may well have deflected. And it actually did deflect off the defender's left leg. And deflect into the bottom corner. 2-1 Chelsea. Fabregas and Drinkwater scoring our goals. Got a chance to make a change. Morata hasn't had the best of games. Get him on for, off for Batshuayi. Um, and that shall do for the time being. 23 minutes to go. We're still 2-1 up at the Vitality. Morata, the changes haven't yet been made. William, this is nice. Zappa Costa to William. Zappa Costa. Morata, 2 0, or 3 1 even. Don't know why I said 2 0. It's 3 1. Very nice passing move. Morata in behind, scoring another guy, and he's about to be substituted as well. He hasn't had a particularly good game, but Zappa Costa to William. Back to Zappa Costa, into William. He, he wrong footed Degovic and pokes it home for our third of the game. 
and confirms our spot in the fourth round of the Carabao Cup. That's a lovely bit of play from Drinkwater. Batshuayi, impact sub, 4-1 at the end of the game. Lovely bit of play in the build-up by Danny Drinkwater, who scored our first goal. Lovely bit of play here. And uh, played it into uh, Fabregas, but Batshuayi picked up the loose ball and makes it 4-1 with pretty much the last Kick of the game. Drinkwater, Fabregas, Morata and now Batshuayi scoring the four Chelsea goals today. It ends 4-1 at the Vitality. Into the fourth round of the Capital One Cup. Well, the Carabao Cup now we go. Uh, let's go and take a quick look and see what's happening in the next episode. And see who we're going to be facing in the next round of this season's Cup. Uh, Manchester United lost to Everton 1-0. Um, who else was playing? I don't quite know who we're going to face, but uh, Stoke City kicks us off in the next episode. Um, who else? So we're going to have Stoke away, and then Hoffenheim away, at home, yeah, away, and then Manchester City at home to finish off the month of September. And then into October, we'll have Palace, Watford, and Atletico Madrid. The next round of the Carabao Cup is yet to be uh, drawn. But with that said, that's the end of today's episode, guys. Like, comment, subscribe, as always. Share it around. And I shall see you in the next one very soon indeed. See you later.